hey hi everyone welcome to my youtube channel today we will see how to make a gradient color background like uh, if you are an instagram user you must have remember that in the old uh, instagram login ui page uh, we used to get a gradient background whose color changes dynamically let me show you how it looks like so here here it is if you remember you we were getting this type of ui for the login and sign up page so today we will try to uh, design something like this uh, basically a gradient view where the color will, will change the dynamically so let's get started so this is the i have created a new android project and uh, i have done nothing here so first what we will do we will uh, we will um, update the color values like what all colors we need so as you can see here i have written some purple shade and indigo blue light blue like this so we are done with the colors now what we'll do we will create a three gradient files basically a gradient three gradients so let's start doing that go to the drawable folder and uh, create a new drawable resource file name it gradient one now the root element should be the gradient Should come here. Sorry, the root element should be the shape. And here it is. Here. Make a gradient. Close it. Inside this. Try to go. We'll start with the start color. So here we give the starting color of the gradient view. And uh, which I would like to give the deep purple. Which I have declared in the color section. Here it is. And now we need to give the end color. End color, and I will give it purple 500. Okay, now we will give the angle of the gradient, and that will be 0. So this is for the gradient 1. Now, similarly, we will create two more files. The same manner, for, like how we have created for the gradient 1. shape just copy paste from the previous file and here just change the color make it indigo 500 blue 500 and angle 45 this uh, with the angle and the colors you can play with yourself i have just um, using some values it will work fine now we need to create the last file last gradient file gradient 3 and the root element should be shape that's all so we will copy paste here we will give some different color sand 500 and light blue and here I am giving the angle 90 ok now Okay, uh, let me recap what all we have done here. We have just created three gradient files. Now, we our purpose is to animate these three gradient files. So now we'll create the animation list file and we will try to animate this, this gradient files. So the process is same. In the drawable folder, the same folder, we have to create a new resource file, which is the animation list. Animation list and the root element to be animation list. Okay, no problem. Skip underscore here. Okay, so as you can see, we got the animation list file. Now let's put some animation here. Now we have to call the gradient file here. Drawable gradient one. Now give the animation duration. Let's give six seconds. Now copy paste same code for gradient two and gradient three. Get gradient two. Sorry, should be two here. And here make it three. 
okay now we are done with the gradient uh, animation list file as well now uh, so basically we have uh, we have done all the things now just we have to uh, call this animation list drawable animation in our main ui so for that we will do we will delete this thing just uh, the animation should cover all the parent view complete parent view so the main parent view will set the drawable will set the drawable i mean the background as the drawable animation here we go like this now if you go to the split design you should be getting like this if you are getting this it means whatever we have done till here we got it correct now now, now let's run it and see how it is coming okay 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 cross your fingers yep so as you can see we are the getting we are getting the like gradient view but animation is not working so what what we are doing wrong so uh, basically we just uh, we have set the animation drawable animation in the xml file but we have to activate the animation from the uh, main dot uh, from the main file for that we will create a reference to the drawable animation in the main activity file and we'll activate it so let's let's do that so okay let's create a variable here And it should be of type animation driver. Okay, so it is crying. Okay, make it getting it. So now driver animation. Okay, one more thing we have to do. We need to get some ID here so that we can call it from the code file. So let's give it main as ID. Here it should come. Yeah, it's coming. In view dot background as animation drawable. Now here we need to give some fade in and fade out timing. So let's give it five seconds. The fade out should be. Let's say the fade out time. Let's give it two seconds. Now we need to activate the animation that we do in the on start function. So normal animation dot start. Now let's run it and check it how it's working. Is it working? Yeah, bingo, we got it working. Now now we can we can modify it. Uh, you can see the top bar title is visible here. So to hide that, what we can do is we can do support action bar dot hide. It is just to make it in a full view. So run it again. Yeah, you can see the title bar is no more visible. So yeah, we did it. If you like the video, please subscribe and like the channel. Thanks for watching.